Greetings folks, it's Sarah with Obadiah's. Today I have featured the Pioneer Duchess, which is the brand new cook stove by Pioneer Stove Company, which is a Amish cook stove manufacturer here in the United States. They are located in Greencastle, Pennsylvania. Today, I just finished a factory tour, and I'm here to show you guys this new model and do a technical overview for you guys today. So the first thing I wanna point out in this technical overview is it's July 2023. This model is not UL or ULC listed at this point. We are still in the paper work process pending for testing approval okay so it'll probably be at least fall 2024 if not the 2025 season before we actually have all of that paperwork um, available on this particular duchess model so if you need that to have that um, UL certificate requirement that's generally for insurance purposes then you will have to wait on this model um, otherwise it's just to get the product out there and show you guys what it's all about okay so in regards to clearances any non-UL or ULC appliance um, has to be a minimum of 24 inches off the wall unless the manufacturer is stating otherwise right now pioneer is saying that this duchess model should be 25 inches off the rear and the sides of the stove so if you are going with this non-ul model that would be your requirement they are hoping that when that ul testing comes through that those clearances are going to be much lower so we're waiting for that um, other than that, this model does take a seven inch chimney flue. It is super important to actually install a seven inch chimney if you want the stove to work properly. I get so many questions about um, switching to either a six or an eight. The main thing you need to know is if you're doing that, you're voiding the UL safety listing. So if you're waiting for this UL model to come out and then you, you put the wrong size flue, you're voiding your UL. Um, if UL is not a concern for you, then drafting issues could definitely be a problem. When you go up in size, you're not creating enough draft, which means the stove could smoke. When you go down in size, you're creating too much draft, which increases your risk of chimney fire. Um, also, it can create some combustion reburn problems of the gases inside the firebox when reducing the flue size as well. Uh, so those are things to keep in mind. Of course, as professionals, we always recommend and that the correct diameter chimney for that model stove be installed. Seven inch chimney is something that Obadiah's carries. We keep it in stock. So if you're looking for a chimney quote, we do offer 20% discount off of retail chimney prices, as well as free shipping and no sales tax on your chimney order. So be sure to hit us up for a quote on chimney if you're looking for that. Um, otherwise, as far as technical features go, this stove is really a great option if you are looking for a good heater stove with a nice big baking oven. If you're looking to have those extra options, you know, like the side reservoir is a really unique option. Um, because really, actually, I think that the Pioneer Princess is going to be the only porcelain enamel cook stove that I offer that has a side reservoir option um, between the Duchess and the Pioneer Princess, both of which are going to be two Pioneer model cook stoves. Um, so uh, in addition to that, you can change out some features here on the stove that I want to talk about. It does come standard with wood handles. And if you wanted to, you could do um, a spring handle as well. Just It's like kind of just a wire spring handle. The Duchess model is also going to be available with a glass oven door. I know that that was something a lot of people were requesting on the Pioneer stove, so I'm super excited for that. Unfortunately, I don't have that shown here, but I do have have the beautiful glass firebox shown and this is going to be featured with the nickel trim you can also get the door in all black so I'm going to take you guys up close and show you inside the baking oven on this duchess so you can see the nice three levels stainless on the rear and sides porcelain enamel on the bottom we don't actually have an oven gasket on this particular oven door, but there's no problem getting it up to temperature for baking. Inside the fire box 
it is a nice deep firebox. Now this is the Duchess and this is shown with the stainless steel bricks because this model is not UL. Um, it's only being sold pretty much within the Amish community or anyone who doesn't require that UL. And they use a lot of these stainless bricks inside because they heat up quicker. Um, likely when this model gets UL and we have it available for our market, they will probably have standard fire bricks just because it's retaining the heat longer. This is going to be your damper control located at the bottom. This is the one that the auxiliary that they call it, it's bringing combustion air in from under the firebox there. On this Duchess model, this is the one they moved from the princess to the rear to the front. I think it's really nice that they did that. Um, here we have the fan pulled out. And this is gonna be your Duchess cook stove all opened up. All right, so here we have the back of the Duchess, and I'm gonna show you guys these controls. This one here is going to be your shaker, which moves the grate inside the firebox. These brackets here are to add the water reservoir if you wanted a rear reservoir. This slide damper is gonna be your bypass, so you can see that opening and closing. So pulled out is going to be open, pushed is going to be closed. That also circulates the heat around the oven. It's going to be a seven inch top vent flue here. So this is the shaker handle off the rear of the stove and what that looks like inside the firebox there. Here we have up close the water reservoir option on the Duchess. Again, this nice handle control opens it up. And you can see inside the box, nice water reservoir and a nice port if you want to plumb it in. Top warming oven option. This is available in glass as well. It really does slide quite nice both sides. Nice warming oven. Here we have the summer grate option for the Pioneer Baker's Choice and Duchess. You can see that's about a six inch rise. It's just a simple grate. Super easy, slides in the firebox, so you can easily take it out. This is going to be your technical overview on the Duchess cook stove by Pioneer. If you guys like my videos, if they're helpful, informational, and educational, please give me that thumbs up. It helps me out so much when you guys like my videos. It helps me out even more if you share them with a friend. If you think somebody would be interested in these products, please link them over to our videos. That is excellent and I really do appreciate it so much. If you haven't already, please click the subscribe button in the corner of the channel. Clicking that bell is going to update you with all of our latest video notifications. God bless, have a wonderful day and thanks for watching.